Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 60 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 5, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, this weapon is for Lumong of Wu. So to get his weapon, you have to go to the Battle of Fawn Castle, play under Wu forces, and of course play as Lumong. So, let us get started. Oh, uh, what attire would be good for him? You know what, this color doesn't seem that bad. Still basically woo colors. Alright, this is a two-star map, so it's not gonna be a very hard level. This tiger hook that I got right here, the fourth one, is actually pretty good because it has attack and luck. Don't think I need the serpent earrings anymore, so I'm gonna give him the wind scroll to be even more dangerous. My bodyguard, I'll bring in Fa Fong, because now he's got higher link and wall. And our objective, of course, is to defeat Guan Yu, and to make sure ourselves, or Sal Ren, does not get defeated. So, let's do this. What news, Lu Meng? I've withdrawn the troops, as you suggested. This should do it. His overconfidence will breed carelessness. While fighting the enemy, we can... Sir, is something wrong? No. I was just thinking of... What a fine strategist you've become. It is time! This army shall bring death to Guan Yu! Team up with Wei to capture Guan Yu! Wu has come to assist Wei. What can they achieve with such few troops? Alright, so in order for you to get the fourth weapon for Lu Mong, well, one of the things you'd have to do is capture one of those enemy checkpoints in the middle of the map to allow the Wei reinforcements to get in. Sometime after that, you would have to defeat Fu Ren and Mi Fong to get them to defect. After that, you had to defeat Zhang Bao and Zhang Fei when they show up. You also have to make sure Mi Fong and Fu Ren are still alive at the time of this happening. Keep in mind on this map for the Wu forces, the flood attack already happened. So you're not preventing that anymore. Oh, so let's take on some officers around here. Who is that anyway? Oh, that's Guan Squall. Fair enough. It's over already. Enemy officer defeated. All right, so I say once we take out some officers, Fawn Castle will have a little bit of protection. I already liberated that check one. Yes, I did. Okay. Yeah, my memory isn't always the best. I mean, yeah, it's had some good moments. However, that was probably one of them where it didn't come good. The enemy commander is mine. No, it ain't. Is this the end? Enemy officer defeated. I find that Lumong's Muso is actually pretty overpowered. Like it can get a nice bit of damage in, and it's very accurate compared to some other Muso attacks. So I have no qualms using it here, especially with a wind scroll. You are alone. You must long for death. Rao seems to be alone. The new fan of Fu Shiren. Indeed. Attack like, them both. Can I hit him, please? Well, still, the common woes of just not being able to hit anybody. Oh, I didn't even see it in Musou already. Enemy officer defeated. There, I'll take that. All right, so let's just make a beeline for Guan Yu's base. But first, there's a Musou Rage in that box right over there. Might be a good idea to take that. That way, it'll give us a little bit more peace of mind. Good luck if you think you can break through our defenses. Well, if you kind of have to wish me good luck, I might as well just kill you nicely. 
Alright, over here is Guan Ping. Let's defeat him. Oh, he fucked the entire thing except for that one hit. Oh, there's a little bit of a delay between your attacks and your sixth charge. But it's good enough. Enemy officer defeated. Alright, Fu Shiren should be to the north and Mi Fong to the No, Mi Fong's to the north and Fu Shiren's to the right. So while we wait for John Fei after I complete these next two steps, I could probably just kill some officers. The best course of action is to give in to Wu. They'll automatically defect once you do a nice bit of damage to him. So that saves you a little bit of trouble. And they'll just go to Fawn Castle and make sure that it's protected. I refuse to put up with this. So that you might want to be careful to make sure that you don't kill them, especially when news plans are going along and you know they don't get a chance to get their dialogue in. Let's take this checkpoint too. I don't think this one's required. Just the one next to Fawn Castle. I'm gonna take that defense base to the south too. It would be my best interest to do that. There, that's better. That'll keep the gates open. Did you think you could overcome this base? Yeah, where are you too? You're over there on the wall or oh you're just on that side. Where did the freaking guard captain go? He go over this side? Dude. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Just scattering around. I was like, what the hell is happening? Yeah, let's try to relieve, like, the enemy forces around Fawn Castle. That'll help me, Fong, and Fushiren stay alive. Says it might be a wall for, for Zhang Fei appears. Hopefully not too long. Here I am, everyone. Shu Huang has arrived. There we go. Lu Meng, victory is ours. I kind of told you that. <laughs> Did you think you could overcome this place? Yeah. <laughs> What officers are around here anyway? Uh, Joe Song's still over there. Let's go defeat him. Oh, that's just a gate captain. I thought there was a guard captain. Never mind. Oh, that's not a guard captain. I'll take this one. There, that'll stem the flow a little bit further. I don't want to fight Guan Yu yet, but I think that if I do, Zhang Fei will disappear faster. Sorry, I'm late, Master Guan Yu. Oh yeah, they got their own reinforcements too. There we go. Damn. It's over already. Enemy officer defeated. Again, I'm not looking to fight Guan Yu yet. There will come a time, but this is not the time. Jeez, it looks like their reinforcements are moving fast. So I think they need to die. So it looks like they're ready to cause a bit of trouble. Let's see, who's this one over here? Is that... Lu Fong first or Mangda? Yeah, it's Mangda. The enemy 
commander is mine. Come on. Oh, I wanted to get that crossbow guy. You truly are a mighty warrior. Yeah, anyone can be mighty too if you're equipping this many items. Enemy officer defeated. Oh, Lu Fong is actually closing in. Can't allow that to happen. So I can hit him from behind. I don't know if there's any way you can get Zhang Fei and Zhang Bao to show up faster, maybe other than take on Guan Yu. I think it's just a set amount of time. Oh, geez, I passed him. The enemy commander is mine. <laughs> Damn. Enemy officer defeated. We practically got things well wrapped up here. So now we play the waiting game. Hey, when you have conditions where you actually have to wait to take someone out, because they're just not there yet, it's just annoying and just cuts the momentum to some sort. But either way, we pretty much got this in the bag. Worst thing that can happen is if I kill Zhang Fei first, and then Zhang Bao runs away and uh, he's gone from the map. So that's very unlikely to happen. So let's take this defense base too. Think you could overcome this place? I took the rest of them. What else do you have? I think I'll go take out Maliang. He's a sub officer. Oh, that didn't kill him. Listen. You do not require strategy. My ambitions left unfulfilled. Enemy officer defeated. Oh yeah, we got this. Where are you, Junk Fei? Sorry to keep you waiting. Yeah, I think it'll show up sometime after Xu Shang appears. I don't know about how long, but oh, never mind. Good thing I was heading that way. Keep up or be left behind! Okay, Zhang Bao should be to the north. Is he? Ah, uh, pretty close. In the center. He should die faster than Zhang Bao anyway, because he's not hyper mode. Are defeated. Okay, let's do this. Are you prepared to face me? More prepared than you'll ever know. It was well worth it. Oh, I was gonna use my moose so he got me up. Oh, more crossbows. Good thing I had a defense up at that time. Nice. How many archers or crossbowmen are there? Way too many to even count, I'm sure. Then again, one is too many. Thanks for that defense up. Just not me too. Beautiful. 
Oh, he's almost defeated. Good thing there were some troops around. They help out with your Muso. How could they have been hiding this many soldiers? Quickly, do everything you can to destroy Bond Castle. And there is your weapon, just to the very northwest of the map. Brother, forgive me. Our oath. Enemy officer defeated. Okay, we fulfilled our conditions. Now, when I actually tested going for this weapon, I tried not sealing that checkpoint. And granted, even though my allies did release the checkpoint for Shu Wong to appear, I did not get the weapon. Which leads me to believe I had to do that myself. So, obviously I did that, that's why I got the weapon. Did you think you could break through our forces? Alright, let's see if I can avoid aggroing Guan Yu in the meantime. Because I want to get the weapon and then fight him. He's right here. Beautiful. Now let's go defeat him. Defend yourself, or suffer death by my blade. The end is near. I shall deal with this insult well. I didn't know you had it in you. My strength is devoted to killing you, Guan Yu! Alright, unlike the map against the wave forces, he does not go into rage mode. He just boosts his attack from pure time. Which is not bad. Better that than rage mode. Where it's gonna be boosted anyway. Not a whole lot of other nasty side effects. They are powerless to stop us! Let's keep willing him down. You can take a lot of hits. I will forever fight for my brother's ambition. Oh, he does go into hyper mode. Never mind. Or rage mode. I thought he didn't. But it didn't matter. <laughs> Your skills are impressive. Though I have failed as a warrior, this is a glorious end. Farewell, and thank you. And there we go! That was an easy victory for us! We we're not in any danger of any kind. It just took a while, that's all. And that's Zhang Fei to blame for that. Alright, so this is the weapon, the White Tiger. Has a power of 36, charge of 15, horse of 15, bow of 15, defense of 17, and life of 17. Yeah, definitely taking it. Then again, I'll be taking them all anyway. So, that would be, what, 19th of 4th weapon we gotten? So, we'll save and call it an episode. See ya, everybody. Secure this land for woe! <laughs> <laughs>